Glory be to God for this time. We pray in Jesus' name that even as we leave our homes to our different places of work and engagement today, the Lord shall bless us in the name of Jesus Christ. We are going to be considering Matthew chapter 22, verse 36 and 37. Master, which is the great commandment in the law? And Jesus said unto him, Thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thy heart, and with all thy soul, and with all thy mind. This is the first and great commandment. And the second is like unto it, that thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. On these two commandments hangs all the law and the prophets. Each of days we glorify your holy name. We thank you, Lord, because when we are far off, you brought us to yourself, to your son, Jesus Christ, and you brought us home. Dying and living, he declared your love. He gave us grace. He opened the gate of glory. Lord, we pray for our nation, Nigeria, today. May the spirit of love dwell among your people. We pray for those in leadership or position. Lord, we pray in the name of Jesus Christ that we grant to all our leaders the spirit of unity, love, and concord. That on daily basis, people may honor one another in this nation and seek the common good. We pray in Jesus' name that, Lord, love will continue to grow. We will see one another as brother, as one who needs help, and we will surely commit ourselves towards assisting others in times of need. We pray for as many that need help at this time, O Lord. You will stretch forth your hands of blessing and you shall help them in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, teach us how to treat our brothers as ourselves. How to look on daily basis with hope, courage, and strength in you, O Lord. Grant unto us the spirit of love. Grant unto us the spirit of unity. Grant unto us the spirit of peace. That on daily basis in this nation, there shall be peace in Nigeria. There shall be peace in Lagos State. There shall be peace in through Lady local government. In the name of Jesus Christ. We pray, O oh Lord, that you will continue to use the church as a source of love to the whole world. To the needy. To the oppressed. To the hopeless. And to those who are sick. Teach us, O oh Lord, how to treat everybody equally. To make them know that truly and truly that you are the God of love. Lord, I will pray that in we see you, may we see love. In we see you on a daily basis, may we see your presence. We pray in the name of Jesus Christ that, Lord, even in every family, there shall be love. Among, between husband and wife, brothers and sisters, cousins, relatives, family relations, there shall be love. Thank you, ever living God. Because we know that you have answered our prayers. We know that you are the Lord. And you change it not. On daily basis, we have cause to praise you and to thank you for what you have done for us and that which we will continue to do. We worship you, ever living God. Teach us how to love one another and how to treat one another with respect. All this we ask through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. <laughs> 